All right, let's uh, let's make a shovel prop. So let's come to new collection. Call that shovel. Shift A mesh circle. Let's go for six vertices. And scale it nice small. I'm gonna hide everything else. Focus on that. Let's rotate X90. So there it is. Okay, let's come into edit mode. And in, oh, there it is, baby. Bring it out a bit. <laughs> Bring it out a bit more. Yeah, papa. Put a face on there. <laughs> Select those J to join those. And I'm going to bring that edge out a little bit. And we'll scale it and just add a little. And three, for face selection, we'll select those faces. We'll hit E and Alt S, and we'll pull out. Now I'm going to scale in the Z. some edge loops here like that and put one there and grab this part E and S bring it down and I'm gonna bring an edge loop out here and up here just getting ready for some division surface might need to squeeze this down Let's see how that goes. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm going to go for three. I think I need one back here. Okay, it's just going to be a small prop, so. And then what we'll do is I'll grab that and we'll go Shift D to break it out and select it heat extrude come up ways and try that let's close this off yes and we will grid fill that and we'll bring an edge loop out here and i think we'll need one down there now i don't need i don't I'm sure i even need a subdivision surface on that let's just try shades nah i guess i will all right but we certainly shouldn't need that much Two. Yeah. Yeah, okay, we'll go with that. Now, let's bring the 3D cursor to, to around here. Is that too thick for me? Scale shift Y. Or thin. Let's go with that. Okay, here's what I was thinking now for the handle. I was thinking of Shift A, Mesh, Circle. I'll try 12. Rotate Y90. And scale. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Yes. Here's what I'm thinking of, guys. It's not a lot of good... Oh, boy. I'm going to grab these three vertices and extrude them out. I hope that's not too thin. I'm just, I'm just trying to eat and I'll come over here. Eat one more and we'll come out here. And then we'll scale Y0. OK, 
Okay, and let's look from the side again. Let's box select all these and get rid of them. And put a mirror on. With clipping. And I could straighten that out. I hope that doesn't pinch or anything. Let's take these. And let's simulate a curve. E and G. curve but it's something now if I take these two let's do that and then let's grab these now I think I need to put the mirror on I'll grab those and that E and S, E and S come right in. Okay, select it all. Oh yes, flip the normals. And we'll go for solidify. Like that. Yes, baby. And drag these out longer. And yeah, it's looking a little thin. All right. Well, we can still adjust a little bit. What if I did that? Let's apply that. No. Okay. And then I was thinking. down the top Not like too sharp or anything hmm. oh boy I'll do another circle here uh, let's uh, rotate y90 Let's put an edge loop there and control B. Pull it out, roll my mouse up to get one, select that, turn on proportional editing and S to scale. Just make sure the white circle is roughly in there. I don't know, what do you think? Do as a as a shovel prop? Okay. Hopefully it's okay. Okay. 
What if I bring back some of this stuff here? And select my shovel. And bring it out. Let's rotate X90 and stand her up. And get the approximate, uh, let's make it smaller. Let's take one of these guys, Shift D, and um, move to collection shuffle. Good, 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 good. That's what we want. Bring her over here. first place. Scale it down. Let's mirror you across there. my shovel in terms of where it's going to go I'm not quite sure but we'll uh, we'll leave it there for now cool all right next thing is probably going to be an axe gotta have an axe <laughs>